my approach um, is um, that without the, without the macro demand, um, you can optimize supply, but it won't lead, lead uh, to much. So I think the, the bigger question is the macro question on, on the question of, uh, um, you know, is there the sufficient supply of inputs in the economy? Are the incentives correct? Is the labor law designed in a way that it incites job creation and so on? Um, do, do institutions matter? I mean, there's, there's a, a lot of institutions like unions, uh, employers associations, chambers of commerce that play important roles in, in constructing the economy, constructing the, uh, the labor market more specifically. And so I think it's not just thinking about the, the hard type macro regulation questions, but also about institutional questions uh, that create labor demand. Uh, and then, of course, there's the supply of qualified labor that's available, that's mobile, um, that is able to work also, uh, you know, to an older age, which is a very important question in Europe, uh, which is also a, a question for the, Euro uh, for the Eastern European region, Central Asian region, with the demographic pressures that apply on the supply side.